How's it going everybody? I'm Drifty from Driftwood Gaming. This is a quick tutorial on how to set up Dragon Bones integration into your project in a hurry. Step zero, back up your project. It's easy to back up your project. Simply right click your project folder, hit copy and paste it anywhere except in that same folder location. Step one, open your project. Step two, click on game open folder. This is going to open up the file destination path. Step three, visit akashix.mo and download the sample project or some copy paste code that we're going to need later on. It'll be the first link in the description below. Step four, go to the Green Kells itch page. It'll be the second link in the description below for the asset integration library files. Click on download. Step five, save and extract the zip file you got from the Green Kells itch page into your project folder. You want to Make sure that you see Dragon Bones Assets and Dragon Bones Source folder inside of your game project folder. You may need to overwrite existing files. Step 6. Go to yanfly.mo and get the latest version of the Dragon Bones integration plugin, as well as its dependencies. Once you have Kel Yep's Dragon Bones plugin and all of its dependencies, place them in this order. You'll need the Core Engine, the Battle Engine Core, and its action sequence packs, followed by the expansion, animated SV enemies, and underneath all of those you want to place the Kel Yep Dragon Bones plugin. Step number seven, open a Kashyyyk sample project folder. Step eight, copy the Dragon Bones asset folder from a Kashyyyk sample project and paste it into your project folder. You may need to replace files. Step 9. Open Akashic's sample project in MV. Step 10. Open the database and click on the Enemies tab. Step 11. Copy the Dragon Bone settings from the notebox. Step 12. Open the database for your project and paste the code into the notebox for any one of your enemies. Step 13, add that enemy to a troop. Step 14, event a way to test battle. Step 15, play test the battle. And voila, you've installed the Dragon Bones plugin. If you've enjoyed this tutorial, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you're new here. This video was brought to you by the generous patrons at patreon.com. Thank you so much for all of your support. If you'd like to support what I do, please consider backing me on Patreon. Links will be provided in the description below. Hopefully you've enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. Why are words hard? <laughs>